Hi, today uh, I wanted to make a video of a three-phase electric motor that a friend of mine gave me about a year ago, and uh, it doesn't work right now uh, because I don't have three-phase anywhere near my house. The closest is about a mile away, um, and I know that that would cost a lot of money for the power company just to bring it up here just for me. Uh, and I don't, also I don't want to pay the electric bill for three phase because I've heard it's in the thousands uh, just for other things unless that you tell them that you make enough money and they'll give you a deal. Uh, but I don't do anything like that so I just wanted to r get this thing running but I don't have any way to run it so I did some research and the motors can run off of a frequency drive or a rotary phase converter but I don't have the money for that right now and I also I just want some information about the motor so I'm gonna grab the camera and uh, I'm gonna name some things out and hopefully someone can help me um, so thank you and uh, hope someone can help hi um, this is the motor and it's a five horsepower AC three-phase motor and it has a, I think it's about a one inch in diameter uh, shaft with a key drive, I'm not sure, so, but it's a heavy duty and it says high efficiency ball door electric motor and it's, it says uh, ball door industrial motor, three phase and five horsepower voltage is Let's see, where is it on the tag? It's right mm, there. I don't think you can... No, nope, you can't see it. Um, it's 208-230-460. Um, the amperage is 13.2 uh, at 208, 12 amps at 230, and 6 amps at 460. The RPM is 3450, the Hertz is 60 Hertz, because uh, I'm in the U.S. And uh, constant rating, 40 degrees ambient temperature. Um, power factor, I think that means PF, I'm not really sure. 93%, that's a good amount, I guess. <laughs> so, um, the category number is... M three six one three T and the spec number I guess is three six A zero one X one zero zero and I don't know if S E R dot means serial number, so I'll give this number out anyway. It's uh, F nine nine three I don't think it is the serial number because it's really short unless they decided to make a really short serial number and uh, I'm not sure if you need any other information there's a couple more things there's a uh, code K and uh, class F not sure what those mean um, S E R dot F dot is one point one five I'm not really sure what that means either um, so if someone could give me information about that, that would be great. I'm not sure if this runs, so I don't really want to put any mon really much money into it until I can find out a way to test the windings. So I'm going to get a friend of mine or something to test the windings. And, uh, one thing I do want to know is, since it's 5 horsepower, I've done some research on the, uh, ways to run it on one single phase. And because I don't have three phase and I don't plan on getting three phase unless I get an industrialized generator, those are like fifty million dollars <laughs> for buying one of those just for this thing that's not really worth it. Um, so I did some research and I found some things like a rotary phase converter or a frequency drive, variable frequency drive, and I would rather have a variable frequency drive. But the um, not sure if you have to have a 
rotary phase converter to generate the third phase because I've heard that some of the frequency drives generate the third phase somehow. I'm um, not really sure. But I did some research on those and the maximum horsepower is, uh, it goes way past five, but the um, one that the phase converter, the uh, Fe frequency drive, sorry about that, is uh, for the 5 horsepower cannot have single phase going into it and it takes 3 phase in and puts 3 phase out so the only one that was single phase in and 3 phase out was I think it was like maximum of 3 horsepower so I'm wondering if I can get one of those 3 horsepower versions and run this 5 horsepower off of it or get a smaller one at, uh, smaller than 3 horsepower at least because I want to use this in a shop for like a fan and fans usually take about half horsepower motor and I'm wondering if as long as I don't put uh, 5 horsepowers of load on this motor if it will be able to be run so um, if you have any um, answers or questions about this motor please uh, send me a message or uh, a comment and please uh, rate um, and I hope you liked it thank you